Hi, I'm Maya from Shaping Store, and I'm here to talk to you about the Soup Master. The Soup Master is a freezer container that will hold six cups of soup, and you can have it in your freezer ready to go to feed your family at any time. So let me show you how it works. So you take off the clear lid, which is nice because you can see what's actually inside once it's frozen. And there are six individual cubes, each one holding one cup. Now there's also little measurements on the inside that show half a cup, so you could do half a cup or a full cup, whatever you like. Now this is a very flexible container so that when it's frozen, it's going to be easy to pop out and I'll show you that a little bit later. Now the important thing to do is when you have your soup and you want to put it in the container, just make sure the soup is cooled. You don't want to put hot soup in here and then put that in the freezer. So just wait till it cools down after you've had, you've served what you wanted and then you have your leftovers. So you can take your soup here, now get a ladle, and then just easily pour and fill each cube up to the one cup perimeter. There's a line in here that'll show you exactly where to do it. You don't want to overfill it because then it might, the liquid expands in the freezer and then you might have a problem with leakage while it's in the freezer. So I'm just going to go ahead and fill all of these. Okay, now how fast was that? That was pretty quick. Now when you put the lid back on, you have to match it. There's a little indent here for the handle, so you want to match that on the top, just like this. Now it's on. So this lid, you want to put your hands all the way around and press down to make sure it's sealed so that when you do lift it up, it's going to be um, stuck on top. And when you do lift it, I want you to lift it like this. So you put your hands on the length part of the container so that it doesn't pull apart, which it might do because soup can be very heavy. So just hold it like this and transfer to the freezer just like this and you won't have a problem. Just put it like that. And before you do this as well, I should mention, you're going to want to clear a spot in your freezer that's a flat space to put this on because again, if it's not frozen yet, it might move around, you might have some leakage. So make sure you lift it up and put it in your freezer on a flat surface. Okay, makes sense? Next, I want to show you when it comes out of the freezer. So here is another soup I had froze earlier, like this. You can see clearly what's inside. This is a noodle soup. Uh, take your bowl or a pot, depends on if you're going to put it in the microwave or on the stove. So you're going to lift off the lid here, just like this. And you'll see these little frozen cubes here. Now, the easiest way to pop them out is to just put it over like this and push from the bottom. And then this will pop right out. So let me show you that again. You want to push from the bottom like this, and this will pop it out. And there it is. Your frozen cubes. So these are one cup each. Isn't that handy? So you take this and put it in the microwave. I think it's probably about two minutes per cube or so. So put it in the microwave, two minutes per cube. So for this one, I would put it in for, I would say four minutes. Check on it, stir it, and then put it in longer if needed. And there you go. That's the Soup Master. If you have any questions, post them below. And thank you very much for joining me.